Hey guys, are you ready to add some firework flair to your photos? So today we're going to learn how to transform our ordinary pictures with beautiful and captivating firework effects. So if you want your photos to be full of color, light and energy, make sure to join me. So let's get started and have a great time together. So uh, before we uh, get started with the video, I suggest you to go to the link in the description and use our amazing completely free resources we have textures photoshop brushes gradients and also so many amazing free design uh, resources which you can use them in your projects and uh, i hope you have so much fun and enjoy so let's get started right here um so from the link in the description you can uh download our firework textures and as you see uh, it's about 250 amazing realistic uh, fireworks with 4K quality, which you can use any of them you want in any of your designs or projects. And um, depending on uh, the photo I have here, I'm just going to select one of them to my choice, for instance. Um, I think this one is perfect, so I'm going to choose this texture, drag it right here, insert it to my Photoshop drop it here and I just press enter right now so it's exactly uh, in my photoshop as you see it has a black background so how can we remove the background just with a single click you just need to set the blending mode on screen it was a normal before we set it on screen right now and as you see how easy and perfect the black background is removed and now the only thing I need to do is just um, place it right on the sky I just uh, minimize it with Control T, uh, make it a little smaller to the uh, things on the outside, and I think it looks great. It's perfect. Um, I think it's a little uh, not so realistic because the background has a blur to it, but this um, firework is very bright and um, it doesn't have a blur. So what we need to do is to uh, open the filter menu, blur gallery and field blur so we select this option and here um we can um set the amount of the blur i think a nine is a great amount it's perfect so the interesting part is we can also add a uh, bokeh effects so uh, after um um changing this amount right here anymore i um make the amount more you can see that this uh broken effect is added here also i can um customize the color increase it it's amazing it's just like it's on our photo right here so also i can uh, increase this a little more the result is fantastic so i apply it and as you see how beautiful it was available to uh give this amazing firework texture to our photo also we can use one more texture uh for instance i'm going to use uh this firework so i do the same thing just drag it uh on my work um do the same things we've done i uh, set normal to screen i drop it right here so now um i can um use the same filter on this firework i just need to uh, hold alt click on smart filter and drag on the other one it might take a few seconds but as you see how easy uh the same settings is applied to this firework as well and the result is absolutely amazing also you can uh, edit them you just need to double click on this section right here and um customize the amounts increase them or decrease them depending on your taste or what you want from your project so we uh, okay it we apply it and um if you pay attention here this firework is covering the model's head a little and his hair and his face so what we need to do is to just add a mask layer to this um uh, from this section here first of all we need to select your firework layer i uh, select mask and we um click on this white uh, part right here i mean right here uh, we need to select it and select a brush tool i'm just going to choose um uh, one basic brush i think this brush is fantastic and with uh, the black color we just need to cover 
uh, these firework uh, parts from the model's head. And as you see how fantastic we got to exactly what we wanted right here. So it's great. Uh, here we go. We're done right here. So uh, also, if you want, you can um customize your fireworks to different colors and get to any color you want it's very easy to customize the colors you just need to uh, come to this section right here open hue saturation and um you need to just um click on the layer you want to change the color for instance i want to change the color of this firework i'm just going to drop it right here exactly on the top of that layer hold the alt button and I click between these two layers. As you see, um, the shape of my um, mouse has changed just like this. So that means that this color customizing is just uh, for this layer. So in this uh, window, which is opened uh, for us here, uh, we're customizing these handles and amounts. You can get to any color you want, which I think is fantastic. And uh, it can be very, very interesting. So I could do the same thing for the next layer as well. I'm just going to open the same setting. And as you see, I can get to some amazing color combinations. So also to uh, edit the colors, you can use the camera filter. Uh, I select it right here. We have so many options uh, to customize the color, as you see depending on um, the colors you have in your photo or the colors you want in your project. It can have uh, so many different results. Uh, so we're okay. And as you see, our color is customized just like this, which is fantastic. Uh, so guys, uh, in the last um, part of the video, I always suggest you to use the camera or filter. Um, which it gives some more shine and energy to your project and gives you a better outcome and a more attractive project. So uh, what we need to do is in the last part of your project, just from the edit menu, you can select copy merge. Um, you can just hold control V button. So uh, what we need to do is to just get a copy of this layer here, which we uh, did. And I'm going to right click right here and turn it into smart object. And now we open the filter menu and camera roll filter. And here we go. So um, in this window here, we have so many options to customize the colors. As you see, for instance, we can uh, have a control on the colors and everything to do with the colors, honestly. Uh, also, we can change the contrast, the exposure. Uh, and get to an amazing result so I'm getting closer to what I want and all the other um, options which can have a great effect on your project so everything's perfect we just select okay and this is the final result which is fantastic and you can see the difference right here so I hope you enjoyed watching this video so much don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel if you like this video give us so much energy with your like and check out resource boys exclusive uh, products we have so many free products there and you can use it in your commercial and personal uh, projects if you have any questions put your comment under this video i'll answer you thanks so much take care